Hello. So th- today I would like to share an interesting scripture. So I found this scripture really interesting to me and uh, and I will try to put it uh, into probably context that we we may not normally consider it in 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 this context so what is the scripture so this is scripture in proverbs 25 and it's uh, verse 17 proverbs 25 verse 17 and uh, what does it say so it in the niv it says so seldom set foot in your neighbor's house too much of you and they will hate you that's that's the NIV then the New Living Translation says don't visit your neighbors too often or you will wear out your welcome yes so this is it this is the the scripture that I thought I could share about and uh, okay the basic meaning is clear it's clear that you should not you know like visit a friend so so often you should not keep on going there you know like they get tired you know they want to have uh, time to themselves they want to to become themselves they want to just enjoy their lives privately so if you're going there oftenly probably it will mean you want to share like food with them or even time uh, you, you are now kind of uh, invading into their privacy but I went a step further a step further to to think about our lives now so nowadays our, who is our neighbor so I realized that our neighbors are no longer the people that stay like directly next door to us now our neighbors are even closer than than physically so what do i mean i mean nowadays our neighbor can be in the uk and uh, you're in asia or your neighbor can be in america and how do they become your neighbor and how can you set foot into their house so for me um, to expand or to to make it even more relevant their house can be their inbox for example so a whatsapp inbox or messenger inbox so if you're writing someone so often oh hi how how was your day ah i'm just checking on you ah you know like this this kind of speech uh, this kind of uh, follow-up maybe someone will start to get tired when they see a message from you so you may want to seldom inbox your friends or your neighbors or even your relatives you know because they may get too much of you and end up hating you you know like when when we do economics there's a law of supply and demand and the things that are more valuable are mostly in less supply so could it be that as a friend if if i'm not too available for you maybe i'll be more valuable to you (laughs) what do you think about this a friend who gives you more time to to yourself and appears here and there i think they are more valuable than a friend who's always inboxing you how are you how are things what can we do you know so what is the moral of the lesson the lesson is to say look mind your business do your things <laughs> yes those who who are keen to hang out with you they will write you don't be so hungry to get friends or connections just mind your business and seldom sit foot so cheers for now i hope this can help you